We've all been touched by the miracles of modern medicine, but few people understand how medicines are made and the immense effort required to get them to market and into our hands. At any given moment, there are tens of thousands of research teams across the country working hard at analyzing diseases to find out what causes them. Once the treatment target of a disease is found, biopharmaceutical companies start investigating how to act on them, to stop the diseases from getting worse, or even reverse their courses. Tens of thousands of compounds are typically examined, and they come from all over, from natural compounds that already exist, to synthetic compounds made in labs or through bioengineering. Through a long and difficult process of elimination that can take as long as six years, they get it down to a single candidate medicine. Assembling all their findings, the company will now file for permission to do clinical testing with the FDA. This will be the first time that the new drug will be given to people, and safety is the most important concern of everyone involved. If approved, the candidate drug starts to go through a three-phase clinical trial. Because of the emphasis on safety and efficacy, many drugs will not make it all the way through this process. Phase 1 trials are the first in humans, and usually small, focusing on the medicine's safety and how the drug moves through the body. Phase 2 trials are larger, focusing on the medicine's efficacy and dosing. Phase 3 trials are much larger and focus primarily on making sure the medicine is safe and effective for a wide variety of people. After a successful clinical trial, a process that usually takes six to seven years, the biopharmaceutical company files a new drug application with the FDA. A typical application contains hundreds of thousands of pages for the FDA to review in a complex process that requires both time and scientific expertise. Once the FDA has evaluated all the available data, they will approve only those medicines they think are both safe and effective for public use. Even after approval, the FDA continues to monitor medicines on the market. Once approved, the biopharmaceutical company will manufacture and distribute the new medicine to people in order to treat and cure diseases. The result of this process seems so simple. It might be just one pill taken with water twice a day. But how it came to be in your medicine cabinet is anything but simple. For just this one drug to come into being, it has taken up to a thousand people 12 to 15 years and 1.3 to 1.6 billion dollars. It's a long and expensive process filled with stops, starts, and failures. But through it, our lives are made better every day.